Hey YouTube, somebody commented on one of my videos today that it's hard for them to uh, get enthusiastic about cooking when they're home alone. Well, I cook for myself 90% of the time and um, I like to cook. I don't mind cooking for myself. I don't like to eat the same old boring stuff. I'm not really very hungry tonight, so this is what I am making. It's a can of chicken broth and I have maybe an ounce and a half of white chicken meat that I had frozen. I had picked off of a chicken that I baked the other day. And also in the pot I have uh, not even an ounce of angel hair pasta. And I have a scale that I weigh things out on. To that I'm going to add, it's about a heaping tablespoon of uh, frozen peas and a cut up green onion. I love green onions. I use them in just about everything I cook. I like the color and I like the flavor. And I hope I can do this with one hand. I want to up the protein a little bit and so I have an egg here that I, I just broke the yolk. And um, I'm going to add that. I don't really like it all shredded like some egg drop soups um, make them. I kind of like a little bite to them. So. I, bear with me. I'm going to try to put this in here and film at the same time. All right, I'm going to crank up the heat a little bit. In addition to the broth, I added uh, a couple, literally a couple of drops of sesame oil. Sesame oil is really good, but it can be so overpowering if you've never used it err on the side of caution because it'll just it'll overtake your whole dish and it, it's actually very unpleasant if you have too much of it. Put in some black pepper, a little sprinkle of garlic powder and onion powder and then about a quarter teaspoon of this um, stir-fry sauce. I don't have any soy sauce at home but this is just as good and again very very um, you know restrained on how much you put in. Like I said I only put a quarter teaspoon in and that's more than enough to season this. So I see my egg is starting to cook up. And my meal is pretty well done. Now, I don't know whether this looks appetizing to you or not. I know I really enjoy soups. Uh, I'm a real soup eater and a soup cook. I eat it a lot. But to me, this looks very appetizing. I'll probably put on a little bit more black pepper, but that's it. I'm sorry about the ugly little pot, but that's about the size that uh, for the amount that I wanted to make. And um, if you have any questions, just leave them, okay? I know this is pretty easy to follow, but okay. Just wanted to show you something that somebody could make for themselves.